The latest in news, sports, travel, finance, and much, much more can now be found by every member of your family in a fun, exciting way. We'll show you how right now as we play the Prodigy Challenge. Prodigy is an online computer service that is designed for consumers. The Jones family, that means we go to Victor to see what he found out on Prodigy. The Prodigy Challenge as a, as a game show concept is something that we developed so that we could better educate consumers as to what the Prodigy service is and how easy it is to use. And let's go to sports. And here's the question. You will find late-breaking news and information on 10 sports listed under Select a Sport. Name two that do not involve a ball. All right, the Portugal family has found out what Linda found on Prodigy. Auto racing. Right. And hockey. Hockey, right. Auto racing and hockey. Right of five seconds, that brings a total of ten. I think the Prodigy Challenge represents a new kind of television programming in that it, it truly meshes advertising with entertainment. When I formed Productions Direct, uh, the purpose of Productions Direct was to, to go into the Hollywood community largely and go into the, the depth of talent that's in the Hollywood community and to create new shows, to take exist, not to reinvent the wheel, but to take existing formats, television formats, valid television formats, and combine them with advertising and make a new vehicle, which is the Fortune 500 infomercial. In the 50s, we had a marriage between advertisers and television programming, and that was really what drove new programming in the 50s. Uh, what I see happening is that advertising is going to drive all the new media, the interactive media, and so forth, and when the advertisers start to come on board and realize that infomercials are the stepping stone for them into new media, that this, this whole infomercial programming is going to really take off. This infomercial is really a new technique for major advertisers, and I think that what it is is the agencies are just beginning to learn about it. I think a lot of major agencies are looking for ways to do this. Their clients want it. They see it as a new medium, and they've got to begin to learn about it. And for us, it's exciting for us to be in the introductory area of something that is really quite classy and can work for us. Congratulations! Congratulations! A typical infomercial is where uh, some some of the people on there act really goofy. They're hyper, um, like it's the greatest product in the whole world, and it's not realistic. This is like a regular game show, and uh, people are just having regular reactions and, and, and using the product. It had a plot, and it was an actual show instead of just watching, oh, gee, this cyclonic oven does this, and this CD player does this. There were things to think about instead of just watching mindlessly while they touted their commercial message to you. All right, this is Peter Tamarkin saying bye-bye for now, and tune in next time for... The Prodigy Challenge! Yeah, that's it. Okay, bye-bye.